Good morning, everybody. The intention of the Mass is for expectant mothers. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins, and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ, have mercy. You plead for us at the right hand of the Father. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Let us pray. O God, eternal majesty, whose ineffable word the Immaculate Virgin received through the message of an angel, and so became the dwelling place of divinity, filled with the light of the Holy Spirit, Grant, we pray that by our example, we may in humility hold fast to your will. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. A reading from the prophet Isaiah. The Lord spoke to Aha and said, Ask the Lord your God for a sign for yourself, coming either from the depths of Sho or from the heights above. Noah Zah answered, I will not put the Lord to the test. Then Isaiah said, Listen now, house of David. Are you not satisfied with trying the patience of men without trying the patience of my God too? The Lord himself, therefore, will give you a sign. It is this, the maiden is with child and will soon give birth to a son whom she will call Emmanuel, a name which means God is with us. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Let us enter. He is the King of glory. Let Good us Lord. enter. He is the King of glory. The Lord is the earth and its fullness, the world and all its peoples. It is he who set it on the seas. On the waters he made it firm. Let the, Let Lord, the Lord enter. enter. He is the, the King, King of, of glory. glory. Who shall climb the mountain of the Lord? Who shall stand in his holy place? The man with clean hands and pure heart, who desires not worthless things. Let the, the Lord, Lord enter. enter. He, he is, is the, the King, King of glory. glory. He shall receive the blessings from the Lord and reward from the God who saves him. Such are the men who seek him, seek the face of the God of Jacob. Let, Let the, Lord the Lord enter. enter. He, he is, is the, the King, King of, of glory. glory. Let us stand for the gospel. Alleluia, alleluia. Emmanuel, our King and lawgiver, come and save us. Lord our God, alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. The angel Gabriel was sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth to a virgin betrothed to a man named Joseph of the house of David, and the virgin's name was Mary. He went in and said to her, Rejoice so highly favored. The Lord is with you. She was deeply disturbed by these words and asked herself what this greeting could mean. Then the angel said to her, 
Mary, do not be afraid. You have won God's favor. Listen, you are to conceive and bear a son, and you must name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called Son of the Most High. The Lord God will give him the throne of his ancestor David. He will rule over the house of Jacob forever, and his reign will have no end. Mary said to the angel, But how can this come about since I am a virgin? The Holy Spirit will come upon you, the angel answered, and the power of the Most High will cover you with its shadow. And so the child will be holy and will be called Son of God. Know this too, your kinswoman Elizabeth, who has in her old age herself conceived a son, and she whom people call barren is now in her sixth month, for nothing is impossible to God. I am the handmaid of the Lord, said Mary. Let what you have said be done to me. And the angel left her. The Gospel of the Lord. Mary's yes to the angel Gabriel was has eternal consequences. Mary had taken in a full-time perpetual responsibility which unfolded time and eternity. She bore and delivered the Savior into the world. She taught him as he grew up, suffered for him and prayed for him in his ministry. She shared the pain of his death and then the joy of his rising from the dead. In heaven, her role is to continue the work of her son in making him known and loved. When we say the Hail Mary, we ask her to pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. That is part of her perpetual responsibility until the Lord comes again in glory. In our own small way, we share in that responsibility when we humbly say yes to whatever the Lord asks of us. Let us pray. God of power, God of the poor and the humble, we thank you today for choosing Mary as a virgin mother of Jesus, your son. Her faith and willing service open the way to your new world. Dispose us to seek your will and to cooperate with your plans that we too, like Mary, may give to the world its Savior. Lord, hear us. <clears throat> we ask Our Lady to intercede for us as we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, in the hour of our death. Amen.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you. Fruit of the earth and work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you. Fruit of the vine and work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. Look, O oh Lord, we pray upon the one sacrifice of your Son, that by participating in this mystery we may possess at last the gift we have awaited and for which our faith bids us hope through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For all the oracles of the prophets were told him, the Virgin Mother longed for him with love beyond all telling. John the Baptist sang of his coming and proclaimed his presence when he came. It is by his gift that already we rejoice at the mystery of his nativity, so that he may find us watchful in prayer and exultant in his praise. And so with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory, as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory, O in the highest, yes, I is he who comes in the name of the Lord. O in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, fount of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending thy spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this all of you and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith, we proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, and Mark, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that to the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, our spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints, who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be coerced to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. 
are the Savior's command informed by divine teaching we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. The peace of the Lord be with you always. <clears throat> Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Amen. Body of Christ. Amen. Body of Christ. 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 Amen. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Body of Christ.
Let us pray. Grant divine protection, O Lord, to those you renew with this heavenly gift, that to those who delight in your mysteries, you may give the joy of true peace through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace, the Mass is ended.